Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Angelus, and for today's videos, videos, for today's video, I'm actually going to be talking about my hair and how I take care of it and what I do and what I've done to get my hair this long. Um, right now it's actually curled and I curled it last night, so it's still going to have, it's like, it's still going to be up there, but, um, my hair is actually pretty long when straightened or when wet. Um, let me go ahead and show you. It's like this. Um, if it's not curled, it'll be up to here. Um, so yeah. Uh, let me go ahead and get started and tell you what I've used, um, over the year to get my hair. To have gotten my hair to be the length that it is now. Um, so let's just get right to it. I'm sorry, I just don't want to make this a really long video. Um, uh, so what I used was castor oil. I've only seen castor oil at CVS. I haven't seen it in any other store. Um, castor oil, um, what I do, it's a little white, it's not even white, it's like invisible, like you can't see it. And it smells really good to me, a lot of people, I've seen other reviews, and the reviews say that they can't stand the smell, but I personally don't find the smell to be, um, like something that you just can't use the, the product again. Um, so yeah, what it basically is that it, um... I'm sorry. It's a hair and scalp moisturizing, healing, straightening, and conditioning product. Um, it is an excellent conditioner for natural, pressed, relaxed, or color treated hair. And um, more, it yeah, it says use daily to condition, moisturize, and restore natural sheen to your hair and scalp. Helps prevent split ends and breakage. So yeah. Um, and then it it does. It doesn't just tell you that it makes your hair grow, but it really does make your hair grow. Um, you just use a little bit because if you use way too much, your hair can tend to look a little greasy. And when I do use this product, I tend to use it at night and I wash my hair the next morning. Um, so that's that for that product. Um, this retails for around three bucks. It's awesome. That's what I'm saying. Get it. It's worth it. What I use to um wash my hair is the Pantene Pro V. Um, it's silicone free as you can probably see on the bottle and the shampoo was clear silicone free um, and it smells really good and this I got I got two um, and they were both to buy to get get them for four dollars something like that but I was so stupid I only got two I didn't get like eight so yeah mm, and then for conditioner I really honestly I don't always use this um, shampoo. Um, why? I tend to switch up my shampoos every now and then because your hair will get used to it. So pretty much over the time, your hair won't really, it won't make any difference to your hair because your hair has already gotten used to it. So that's why I like to switch up my products every now and then. So like I was like that. Ugh. Now that being said, I use two conditioners. I use the L'Oreal. Um... What is it? The triple resist reinforcing conditioner. Um, it's brand new. Like I just used it last night. It's like super heavy compared to the one that we've all used up already. The Tresemme. Um, it's the reinforced re moisturize. That's what it is. Um, and this one's like all the way down here. It's like gone. Um, and yeah. I like to switch up my shampoos and my conditioners every now and then. I'm not really big on conditioners, um, but when I do use conditioner, before I apply the conditioner, I squeeze all the water out of my hair and then just apply the conditioner and let it sit there for two, three minutes and then rinse it out. Um, and when I do not wash my hair every day, I wash it every other day or I wait at least three days to wash my hair. I do wash my body on the other hand though, but... When I um, don't wash my hair and my, I feel like my hair is getting um, oily, I do use the um, Tresemme Fresh Start. It smells really good. Um, I really honestly haven't tried any other dry shampoo, so I really can't say what I like and what I don't like about it. The one thing that I can say is that it does leave white stuff on the parts that have oils. Um, what all I do to get rid of that is just like tap that tap that dust off or whatever it is that white stuff off tap it like if I have a weave or something like that and it comes right off and that's it um 
that's basically it. And then for when I do style my hair, obviously before I put heat on it, I'm obviously going to put a uh, heat protectant spray, but at the moment I just can't seem to find it. But when I am finished styling my um, hair, I like to put a smooth intense frizz teaming serum from L'Oreal. And this is basically what it looks like. Um, and that's it. I'm really a sucker for good smells, so everything that I have smells bomb. It smells so good. So, I don't know. Give it a try. Um, all of these products you can find at a drugstore. This one, uh, I've only seen at CVS. So, $3. I definitely tell you to go get it. It's worth it. And to me, it smells really good. And I've had it for over a year now. Over a year and a half. And I still want it. Alright, guys. My um, memory to my iPod's camera kind of got full. So, I had to, like, you know delete some images so I can have space to record this video so yeah um, basically that's it to this video um, I'm sorry I look very bummy in this video I'm, I don't care I like to be bummy but um, yeah that's it to this video I hope it wasn't that fast and I hope you guys liked it and I hope you guys have a great day and I have to go pay my dues now so bye guys have a great day